Hey guys, this is Mike Lane with Tattoo.com, sitting here at KnotFest 2015 with Devour the Day. What's up, guys? Hey, man. How are you? Good good, 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 man. So first of all, man, how was your set? It was good. Uh, it was it was earlier than we wanted because we had to get up so early to play this morning, but it was awesome. It was well, awesome. I, I've been hearing a lot about this breakfast. Uh, yeah, I had an omelet made. Uh, I tried to tip, they wouldn't let me. Spinach, ham, cheese. I, f I felt spoiled today. It was good. The metal breakfast of champions. Well, cool, guys. Well, let's get right into it, man. Let's talk about your ink. Oh, right on. Actually, uh, as far as which tattoos are my favorite, or... Yeah. Uh, let's start with that. Um, there's a guy named Ben Reese out of Memphis who did most of this arm. Um, my hammerhead, I think most musicians have a koi, and I didn't feel like that was necessarily, uh, I don't know, defiant enough, so I got this scarred uh, hammerhead shark. I have this vulture from um, some tracks that we did in Florida uh, that never were released, so it's kind of a rest in peace to uh, that. Uh, this octopus uh, representing to be unique. Uh, the death of my old band, peace coming back, uh, and a Smashing Pumpkins uh, ode to being locked in a cage. Cool. Rage. Awesome. What about you? Uh, sadly, I'm tattooless. He's so. tattooless. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Cool. <laughs> yeah. So listen, guys, what do you guys have coming up? Is there anything you want to tell the fans out there? How can we get a hold of you? Yeah. Um, we have uh, devourtheday.com. It has all our shows coming up. We have all the remains really to the end of the year. And then um, we have a new record in 2016 called Sword. It'll come out uh, early next year. And uh, we just signed a razor and tie. Good family. Everything's going well. Yeah. Well, being here at KnotFest, do you guys feel that this culture is embracing of the tattoo? world body art yeah. piercings yeah i think that's uh i think that's we've entered a new generational uh opinion of tattoos you know my the old generation would say you know you're like a sailor or a thief but i think we've gotten past that so just just in your everyday life do you experience any prejudice or anything when you're just walking down the street uh, i think it depends on what part of the country you're in okay can you elaborate um the bible belt yes south you know new york West Coast, no, never, not really. I'm, there's so many more tattooed people here. I, I feel light, you know, today, so. Cool, yeah. cool. Well, listen, I want to thank you guys for your time and the best of luck out there. Devour the day, check them out.